Hello again. I got another little project I just finished. First thing you'll notice is my uh, partially disassembled tricopter, but that's still in the works. There's a reason for that. Over here, you'll see my current project, which is the KK2 board with a couple miscellaneous wires attached. However, those are rather special. It's connected to the voltage, or actually the alarm, buzzer of the KK2. And what this will do is when the buzzer on the KK2 goes on, it will turn the LED light strips off. So when the low voltage alarm goes off, the lights will start flashing. But when the low voltage alarm is not going off, the lights will be constantly on and steady. How I did that was, under each of these little shrink tubes, there's um, two N-channel MOSFETs with a resistor attached to them in a specific way I kind of just brute forced until I found the way that worked. And what they do is basically allow power to go through until the KK2 sends a signal out, and then it blocks power going to the lights while the KK2 is emitting a signal. So, let's uh, plug it in and show what happens. Alright, so, the tricopter's powered up. You'll notice I attached all the wires, and the lights are on. And if you scroll through the KK2 menu, I don't know if it'll show up, but the lights blink slightly every time you go through the menu, which corresponds to the very small beep you would get every time you hit a button in the menu. Now, on the board here, I've set the alarm voltage to one-tenth of a volt, as I don't have the voltage alarm connected right now. But what that will show is, in a second, when the board starts detecting the low voltage, the lights flash. It's perfect. It looks great. I'll be able to see that from space. And, as you know with the... Uh, low voltage alarm, as the voltage gets lower below the threshold that you set, the lights blink faster. Or the, the buzzer beeps faster, but in this case, the lights will blink faster. Now, I did notice that if you set the low voltage alarm really high, you basically get like, seizure flashing. So, you probably don't want to be flying under normal conditions with the uh, lights flashing like that. That could probably be a problem. However, it still looks pretty cool, gotta say. Anyway, that's the end for that project. I'm really happy with it, and the reason why I made this whole thing was because I lost the uh, low voltage alarm buzzer. So, kinda had to make up something else. And hey, this worked out pretty good. So I'll be uh, testing this out in flight pretty soon.